Most home gardeners use green manures to improve their soil. They let them grow until flowering before cutting them down. But here's what's crazy. This one timing mistake is destroying all the benefits they work so hard to create. Green manures are nature's secret weapon for supercharging your soil. These specialist plants like clovers and vetch pull nitrogen out of the air and store it in their tissues. When you cut them down and mix them into your soil, they decompose and release all those nutrients. It's like giving your garden a natural vitamin boost without any chemicals. This technique has been used since ancient farming days because it flat out works. But timing is everything. People love green manures because they solve real problems while connecting us back to traditional farming wisdom. They improve soil health, reduce the need for synthetic fertilizers and boost biodiversity, all by working with nature instead of against it. As climate change concerns grow, these methods are becoming even more valuable for sustainable growth. But here's where the real game changer is. You need to cut the green manures before they flower, not after. When plants flower, they redirect all their stored energy to making seeds instead of building nutrient-rich tissues. By cutting early, you capture maximum nutrients and prevent them from being lost. This simple timing shift means the difference between soil that's merely okay and soil that's absolutely thriving. Next time you're growing green manures, remember the knife comes out before the flowers show up. Your future plants will thank you for it. For more, make sure to follow. I'm Tony O'Neill and this is Simplified Gardening and I will see you in the next one.